Hi everyone. Antenna coverage is a very important factor that determines the network quality. The following video will show you how to adjust the antenna coverage accurately and standard. Notes on technical specification. You have to adjust the azimuth first, fix the antenna and then move to adjust to tilt. The permissible tolerance for tilt is 0.5 degree, with azimuth being 5 degree. After adjustment, the antenna must be fixed, the total tilt and azimuth follow to the design. Notes on labor safety. Compliance with regulations on overhead labor safety. When using a pole, use a safety belt. Shoes, hats, gloves, protective clothing in accordance with regulations. Identify operational hazards such as, electric shock, falling from above, entangled, stuck jam, things falling from above, insect sting. Before adjusting the antenna, you need to prepare the following tools. 1. Slope measuring instrument 2 mirror compass 3 open end wrenches size 13 17 19 4 adjustable wrench 5 hexagonal set 6 human resources 2 people step 1 azimuth adjustment action 1 determine the angle of the cell before adjusting first you use the compass to determine the cell to adjust the cell closest to zero degree is cell 1 next is cell 2 3 next you measure the current direction of the cell has just just been determined and compared with the standard direction according to the CR to determine the standard direction to adjust. To measure the direction, need to choose a standing position 10 to 15 meters from the center of the tower, facing the cell to be adjusted, pointing the mirror at the foot of the tower. When determining the direction to be measured, press on the side lever to fix the compass needle at this time as the current azimuth angle value. No, should be stay away from metal objects that can interfere with the magnetic field, affecting the accuracy of of the compass. Action 2. Determine the angle to adjust. You use the compass to measure the value of the antenna adjustment according to CR in two ways. Method 1. One employee standing below get the correct direction and signal, instructing the staff to adjust the antenna above the tower. Method 2. In case the antenna position has many obstructions, the direction cannot be identified. It is possible to coordinate with the optimal staff to determine the position and direction of alignment. You send the coordinates of the station, including longitude, latitude with the cell direction image to adjust for optimal staff. Optimal staff will use Google Earth to determine the direction and then feedback to you the location determined. Action 3. Adjust the antenna to the specified parameters. Staff on the tower use a wrench to loosen the positions of screws 5 and 6 on the top and bottom sides of the antenna. Note, just loosen just enough to rotate the antenna. Do not loosen the screws too easily to make the antenna slip off the feeder or break the feeder. The antenna is broken. Then, use the two hands to turn the antenna to the left or right, to a predetermined position by aligning the antenna center with the direction of personnel standing under the signal. Staff standing on the ground using a compass to check the direction adjusted to meet the requirements. Action 4. Fixed antenna. After adjusting the antenna direction, you are tightening the screws at the upper and lower sides to make sure. Step 2. Tilt adjustment. There are O2 ways to adjust the mechanical tilt and the electric tilt. A. Mechanical tilt adjustment. M. Tilt. Action 1. Determine the tilt angle of the cell to be adjusted first. You use the compass to identify the cell that needs adjusting similar to the one in azimuth. Then proceed to measure the parameters of the tilt as follows. Apply the slope measuring instrument to the abdomen of the antenna. Turn the control knob until the water drop is leveled between the two lines on the ruler. Now the needle of the ruler will indicate the current tilt angle of the cell. Note, one line is equivalent to 2 degree. Action 2. Adjust the tilt use the wrench to loosen the screws at 1, 2, 3, 4 positions on the antenna regulator, then push the antenna in or out with your hand until a new angle according to the CR is reached. Tighten the screw in position 2 first. Action 3. 
Recheck the tilt and tighten the antenna fix screw. After adjusting the tilt, you use the slope measuring instrument to check the tilt angle again. Until it meets the requirements of CR, then tighten the screws in the remaining positions of 1, 3, 4, 5. B. Adjusting the electric tilt E tilt, proceed to open the electric tilt protection cap. Depending on the type of antenna with different electric tilt, use your hand or hexagon to rotate the knob to change the tilt value in the range of 0 degree 10 degree until reaching the correct value according to CR. Common types of antennas on the rule are 1 scale equal to 1 degree. After tilt adjustment is complete, close the protective cap. At the end of the antenna calibration process, the technician needs to update all azimuth values, add a new tilt to the station management book and update to the NIMS database management software. Some common errors. Not determining the right cell direction to adjust leading to the wrong cell adjustment. Loosen the screws too loose to make the antenna slip out of the feeder or break the feeder or damage the antenna. Using compasses, slope measuring instrument not in accordance with regulations, leading to wrong angle and direction values. The above are all basic operations and precautions necessary to adjust the antenna coverage. All suggestions, please send to the email address, phongktcn underscore vcc at viettel.com.vn. Good luck.